Hey, good evening, everybody. It is Friday. Uh, pretty late, too. We are uh, currently boondocking in the, uh, uh, the town of Staunton, Virginia. And we're boondocking at a, here you see it up there, Cracker Barrel. Uh, we left this morning, late this morning, and uh, took us forever to get here. We made a bunch of stops on the way, no rush. And uh, uh, got here to Cracker Barrel to spend the night. There really isn't a whole lot of RV parks on the way. Um, there's not even a whole lot of Walmarts and Cracker Barrels to stay at, so it's very, very limited. Uh, anyway, got to Staunton, and uh, Staunton is, uh, it's over in the western part of Virginia, in the Shenandoah Valley area. Um, it is where I-81 and uh, uh, I-64 meet up, so tomorrow we'll hop on I-81 and uh, start heading south down towards Tennessee. Um, one of the cool things is uh, about 45 minutes down that way, not far off the interstate, is something called the Natural Bridge. And uh, it looks really awesome and uh, we're hoping to see this. Um, the problem we've had all along is that we were on a uh, uh, kind of a timetable, um, you know, having to go somewhere first up there to Newfoundland and all this, and we just always had somewhere we needed to be about a particular time, and it just put a rush on everything. So we didn't get to see that much like we wanted. So um, now we don't have that timetable. We have no timetable. Um, so we're going to start seeing these things and, and all that. So. Uh, they've also got a uh, Native American village down there. Um, I don't believe it's an original one. I think it is a replica, but I'd like to see it anyway. And uh, we're going to try to see that. Um, and then after that, after we get home and visit everybody, because uh, it'll probably be the last time we can see everybody for some time, um, we're going to head north. Uh, and we're thinking probably Indianapolis. Uh, Kim and I both each have a reason to go there, and after that we'll meander our way up to Iowa. I've got uh, three different things that uh, I want to do there, and um, and then from there, you know, we've got Montana, we've got Wyoming, the Dakotas. Uh, need to go to South Dakota anyway. Uh, that's where our new address is. Uh, maybe get our driver's licenses while we're there and uh, pick up their. Uh, you get a concealed carry permit there for ten dollars and there's not even a test so go ahead and get that done um, and then you know head on back down to uh, uh, New Mexico before it gets uh, uh, too cold up there up north because uh, those storms can really slam into you and and uh, and all that so uh, that's the way it's looking right now and um, we will uh, let you know tomorrow whether or not we got to see the natural bridge and if we do then by golly you're gonna see it hey guys uh, back and um, so we love Cracker Barrel I decided to uh, I wasn't feeling real good I'm still not just real tired and uh, decided to go ahead and get an RV park tonight and rest up and all that before we uh, hit the natural bridge tomorrow um, and uh, was able to confirm that there is parking there for an RV, so we don't have to, uh, uh, you know, rent a car or anything like that. We can actually go there. So if we hadn't had parking, then we just weren't going to go. So it looks like that's on schedule for tomorrow. And uh, the only question is whether or not we'll stay here another day. Uh, anyway, uh, where we're staying is a place called Lehigh Park, and it is part of actually a uh, part of uh, a TA. Uh, truck stop. Uh, they're the ones that have the, all the stuff right around here. Uh, the, they're just, they've taken over. Uh, it's a town called Lexington, Virginia. Small place. Um, we're probably about 20 miles or so, 20-25 miles from the Natural Bridge, which is where we'll go tomorrow. So, um, But I'll go ahead and uh, give you a quick little view of the, of the surroundings. Okay, as promised. There's the TA truck stop that we went and got it from. You actually went into TA to uh, uh, do the park. And uh, then you come on up around here and uh, come in this road right here. And then we parked right here with, you know, full hookups there. 
everything. Uh, the sewer though, it doesn't have a, a screw-in capability, so I didn't mess with that. We'll just uh, use it when we need it. Uh, I'll, I'll do that uh, probably in the morning, unless we stay another day, which she said it uh, was available, it wasn't rented, so uh, we might do another one, I don't know. But that's not it, I mean, it's not bad. It's got, uh, you've got a couple of levels up there. You can see them uh, going up a hill. And there's the bathhouse over there. And you got another set over there. I mean, they're all over. I don't remember how many spots it was, but it was a whole lot of them. There's uh, Kim and Chloe. So, that's pretty much it. Lehigh RV Park. This is in uh, Lexington, uh, Virginia. Hey, everybody. Uh, so, I'm in the laundry of a KOA in Bellyton, Tennessee which is it's about 45 miles uh, southeast of Bristol and uh, about 75 miles uh, northeast of uh, Knoxville um, so it's not exactly what we had in mind uh, we were going to stop at the uh, at a you know, first good uh, good sounding RV park and we got there and it didn't exist um, it had existed but they were under construction now they did all it was gone there was no evidence that it had ever been there so um so we you know struck on out looking for more and uh, we finally found this one uh wasn't too bad with the good sam discount uh and all that it was uh in tax and everything came to like 38 so that's pretty good for a koa and uh but it's nice it's a nice setup uh uh, looks like mostly pull throughs, uh, full service, and you know, all the works like you'd expect from a KOA. So, uh, anyway, we should be uh, back to uh, uh, home in, uh, I don't know, probably, probably take about five hours realistically. Um, but uh, uh, after that, uh, we're not quite sure when, when we'll be leaving, but I'd imagine, you know, within a few days anyway. And start heading north so uh, all in all it's been a pretty decent trip coming from uh, uh, from Chad's house um, I did have one leaking problem that I uh, uh, had uh, mentioned and I'm gonna order the part when we get back to uh, Bobby's house so uh, anyway that's it for now and more later welcome back everybody it is Sunday June the 23rd um, uh, currently, we're in a Walmart parking lot. Uh, a little noisy out there. That's why I'm filming it right here inside the rig. And uh, we're in um, Salem, Virginia, which is about uh, it's about two hours from the Tennessee border, going down uh, 81 South. Uh, we left the Lehigh RV Park uh, late this morning and um, went to the Natural Bridge State Park. Uh, to check that out and uh, give you some uh, video and, and pictures of uh, some of those things. There was other things there to see, but that was the highlight. Uh, to me, that's the one thing that was worth the money, which wasn't much, uh, $8 per adult, you know, that was fairly cheap. A lot of walking. Um, the last thing that you see on the trail is this uh, waterfall, which was uh, absolutely underwhelming. And, um, and then we left and came here to Salem and it was close enough we didn't want to do much more driving at least I didn't um, and we're gonna spend the night uh, uh, there's a goodwill across the street that Kim wants to hit in the morning and, uh, and after that we'll get back on the road I'm not sure where we're gonna stay tomorrow but probably an RV park um, we're trying to do right now we're just trying to alternate it you know one day park one day boondock um, and hope to increase the boondocking as uh, as time goes on uh, we uh, learn the ins and outs of it so um, I'm not sure what time we'll be back to Tennessee uh, back to Bobby's um, but uh, should be in the next couple of days I'd imagine so 
anyway uh, that's it from now and uh, enjoy the uh, images we got for you I want to see what it looks like just coming up on it Yeah. Damn, it's a big one. Hey, Dad, don't put it on me. I did it. Don't post it. Hey everybody, welcome back. Uh, it is Wednesday. Uh, we <clears throat> we made it in last night to Bobby's house. Uh, got all set up and everything and uh, it's nice he's got that 30 amp service he's put in. Did a great job. And uh, so now we don't have any electrical issues uh, like we did before or like we had up at Chad's. Um, uh, so everything's, everything's real, real nice there. Uh, the uh, uh, the the trip down uh, the whole way overall was was pretty decent um, not too many uh, complaints um, however when we uh, we this morning <clears throat> we had to make some uh, decisions and uh, due to other circumstances uh, we're not going to be heading north uh, we are going to be heading west and going back like we've said a few times that we'd like to get back to that Caballo RV park and that's where we're going to go uh those plans will not change and uh we're going to go spend some time there uh reassess and and whatever else um but we will be back on the road at some point in the future and uh meanwhile we are going to relax and uh, uh just get things all straightened out and ready to go so anyway that's it uh for a little while um i'll be back if uh, anything comes up that's in you know seems kind of important and leave another video you guys take care and you can always contact me there talk to you later bye